Welcome back to Run Light Gaming. Um, so, we're basically continuing on from where we left off. Apparently, what we are going to need in order to get a research and development, which is the next big thing that we need, will be getting a specialist. So, uh, what we're probably going to need is to get a little bit more research, because we need to get 200 research in order to do that. So let me just do a little bit of contract work here just to get that to where we can actually get that done. So now we're going to see who we can actually put into being a specialist. So we need so either 700 technology or 700 design. So let's go ahead and find someone. All right, so he's close on technology. He is kind of middle. He's still kind of far. He's still kind of far. Alright, so I think the closest was him. Yep, so we're going to have to boost his technology just a little bit further. So he's pretty close, but we're going to do just one more. Because hopefully that should be just a little bit quicker of one. Because he ended at 699, and we're going to need to get him to 700. So as long as he gets that one extra point at some point here. Apparently he slacked off of me, so let's go ahead and do this research. Unless I have to go to, unless these are where um, they kind of max off at. So for example, this allows you to get up to maybe 699, but then you need to do one of these to go further up. I guess we'll give this a try, but unfortunately that also means we need to get more research again. So. Find more contract work. And we're we'll going to make him a specialist.
Let's just develop a small game. So we're going to do action, RPG, Action RPG, it'll probably be more on graphics. Let's continue with that. Yeah, because it does mention that once you have a specialist, then you should be able to get it, but... Yeah, that's fine. So I averaged out about five there. But it was just meant to be kind of a small game, that... doesn't matter too too much Okay, so I did a quick look over again. I think it actually specifies designer specialists, which may mean that we're actually going to need, I actually have to work on getting a designer up. So at this point, we're going to have to get one of our designers up to par. He is pretty far away though. He's actually my closest, so he may be the one I really need to push for it. So let's grab that one one more time. Generate a report.
I guess it's probably pretty boring to watch right now. And again, he fails me. So... Do some contract work again. Let's go ahead and train him a little bit further. He should get the last three points he needs. Unfortunately, in doing so, we still don't have the research to get his new um, specialization, because I think we need 50 for that. So basically we're pushing for the 50, once we get to 50 we're going to turn him into a specialist for design, which should hopefully unlock the other part, so, oh wait, it's 100 research points, uh, never mind that, so we'll have to wait a little bit longer. So at this point, we're going to make him a design specialist, which will be there. And we'll skip that again. So finally we can re uh, open our own research and development lab. So we'll pay the 